I'm a long-term investor with short-term focus. <laughs> I should have sold at the high. What do you think? That is what uh, probably everyone says uh, when uh, backward sees uh, that was a high. But when you are at a high, you think, okay, is the valuation reasonable? If it is reasonable, it is hard to say, okay, now I sell it. Especially if you have done a lot of uh, due diligence and you know that there could be reasons why the valuation could be much more than the current price. Uh, that is what I felt too with Palantir. True that uh, after a crazy ride from uh, 10 to 40, the multiple expanded a lot, but I believe there are true reasons why on the long term uh, Palantir could deserve uh, such a high valuation. So as we said uh, the other day, when uh, you see the price rising, but also backed by a lot of fundamental news uh, that support the idea that, okay, this price is worth is deserved, uh, then selling uh, is really a mess. I personally find it more difficult to send when to sell uh, rather than when to buy, because uh, unless uh, the price goes completely mad, uh, for instance, uh, Palantir was, uh, when it was $40, it was mad at uh, 50 times price to sales. Uh, when it was uh, around uh, price to sales of uh, 15, 20, in my opinion, it was not expensive. It was not, not uh, cheap not expensive it was there in that uh, fair zone so what i understood and that is what i'm trying to do is that unless the price goes uh, to an extreme uh, i try not to do anything if the price goes obviously too mad uh, in a very little amount of time uh, but basically generating a uh, multiple expansion violent multiple expansion then is worth uh, thinking uh, okay does this company offer still offers a great potential return or maybe it's just better to say okay maybe there, there is another opportunity out there it's always yeah. important to consider not only the company itself uh, but also the range of other opportunities listen i agree it's it's probably the worst thing to do to think oh what i should have done you know the remorse like we said in your video I'm why did they sell <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy how much there is to learn you know what i love about it that there's so much to learn and i think i know Right, because we know the theory. It is true that uh, you don't want to cut your winners, uh, like yeah. Peter Lynch says. Peter Lynch fa famously said, you don't want to cut uh, your flowers, because uh, otherwise uh, you keep uh, keeping the losers. Uh, so yeah. you want your yeah. winners uh, to keep winning. But uh, that is also true that you have to be very cynical and uh, opportunistically in exploiting uh, the opportunities when uh, they arise. <laughs> Good stuff. Thanks, Arnie. We'll talk soon. Yo, thank you. Ciao, ciao. Ciao, ciao.